VR headsets have come a long way, and the Valve Index is starting to feel a bit outdated. We've had a ton of new releases, including more budget-friendly options like the Quest 3S. And guess what? The Meta Quest 3, which had been stuck in third place for a while, finally overtook the Valve Index on Steam and snagged the second spot. But honestly, I think the Quest 2 is going to stay on top for a while. It's got a huge 38% of the VR user base on Steam, with the Quest 3 at 17%, and the Index holding on to 15%. With the Meta Quest 3 gaining ground, we've also got Apple's high-end Vision Pro and the Samsung XR coming soon. So the big question is, when are we going to see a Valve Index 2? Or will we ever? Let's break down everything we know so far and what we're hoping to see. What's the release timeline looking like? The original Valve Index launched in June 2019, and since it's the only one in the Index lineup, it's tough to predict when we'll see a follow-up. There were rumors in 2023 that the Index 2 would arrive that year, but here we are in late 2024 with no official word. At this point, it's likely we won't see anything until 2025 or even later. Valve could be shifting focus to the Steam Deck or other projects, so VR might not be a priority for them right now. All we can do is wait and see. Valve has kept pretty quiet about its VR plans, and while there have been a few signs over the years that they're still in the game, they're known for shelving or tweaking projects that don't meet their standards. VR is a growing and evolving market, with spikes in popularity whenever new products like the PSVR 2 or Quest 3 hit the shelves, only for interest to die down again. Now, with competition ramping up, Valve might just be feeling the pressure to release an Index 2. While Valve hasn't confirmed anything, there are a few promising rumors. Early in 2024, a South Korean radio certification popped up for a Valve product labeled 1030, which seems to fit their internal naming pattern. For instance, the Steam Deck was 10, 10, and the original index was 1007. While this might be tied to the Steam Deck, it's still a hint at something in the works. Even more interesting, data miner Brad Lynch discovered VR-specific code in a September 2024 Steam update, fueling speculation that Valve could be working on a standalone VR headset. What features could the Valve Index 2 have? Rumors have been pretty quiet on this front. Based on the patents, the device might come with its own battery, suggesting it could have standalone functionality. But it's unclear whether Valve is aiming for a Quest-style device or something more high-end that doesn't need to be tethered to a PC. In terms of design, Valve filed some VR-related patents in 2023, though patents often don't lead to actual products. The designs look a lot like the original Index, so Valve could be keeping the same look or just playing things close to the chest. As for specs, Valve could stick to its strengths in areas like field of view, which at 130 degrees is already one of the best out there. They might also look to match or beat the Quest 3's resolution of 2064 by 2208 pixels per eye. Tracking and controllers are two other areas where we could see improvements. What would make the Valve Index 2 stand out? Valve has a real opportunity to push VR forward with the Index 2. First up, they need to ditch the base stations. Most modern VR headsets use built-in cameras for tracking, which makes setup way easier. While base station tracking is super accurate, camera-based systems have come a long way. The controllers could also use a bit of refining. They're already some of the best out there, but making them more comfortable for all hand sizes would be a welcome improvement. A wireless battery-powered design would be a huge step forward too. No one misses tripping over cables, and we've already seen other companies move toward truly tetherless setups. Ideally, Valve may offer two models, a high-end, standalone option for enthusiasts, and a more affordable version to take on the Quest 3. In short, we're hoping Valve goes all in on the Index 2 and pushes the boundaries of what VR can do. What could the Valve Index 2 cost? The original Valve Index wasn't exactly cheap at $999, and with the economy driving up the price of VR headsets, we could see the Index 2 go even higher. Given that the original Index was one of the most powerful headsets at the time, Valve might decide to double down on performance, potentially pushing the price up to $1,500. On the other hand, if Valve is looking to make a more portable option to rival the Quest 3, we could see a price range closer to $500 to $750. But if they go for a high-end standalone product like the Vive XR Elite, $999 or more wouldn't be a surprise. Should you wait for the Valve Index 2? If you're a die-hard Valve fan, waiting might be worth it. 
The original index is nearly five years old, and it's probably nearing the end of its life cycle. Plus, with Samsung's XR device in the works, it's not a bad idea to hold off for now. But if you're looking for something sooner, the HTC Vive Pro 2 or Apple's Vision Pro are solid, if pricey, alternatives. For a more affordable option, the MetaQuest 3 could be worth checking out, especially if you want a standalone experience. That's all for now. If you enjoyed this dive into the Valve Index 2 rumors, don't forget to subscribe for more updates. Catch you in the next one.